Kyle Karsten, Kyle Carey and Yo, August Hamirash, the Ordain Urdegave. Hi friends, Kyle Carey here, and I'm back with new songs in hopes that you'll join me once again in the creation of my new CD, The Art of Forgetting. Since the release of my sophomore album, North Star, a lot of new and exciting things have happened both in my personal and professional life. I've toured the West Coast, the Midwest, Nova Scotia, the UK, and Europe twice, performed at Celtic Connections Festival in Glasgow, filmed my first official music video, assembled an all-star team of support, and last but not least, found love in new and surprising places. All of these experiences have informed my songwriting, and even though life has been busy in the past two years, I've managed to find space within it all to write new songs. Songs inspired by stories that I hear, by the people that I meet on the road, the places that I stay in and pass through, all of these things have inspired my songwriting. I've grown immensely since the release of my sophomore album, North Star, and I feel as though this growth has resulted in some of my best songwriting yet. So I will be heading down to Louisiana in January to record these new songs with my producer, Dirk Powell, at his studio, The Cypress House, near Lafayette. Dirk is a highly experienced producer, an expert in both Appalachian and Cajun music, and someone I have dreamed of working with for years. With the help of guitarist Sam Broussard of Steve Riley and the Mamou Playboys, we will be introducing a subtle Southern influence into my own Celtic American fusion, making for a new direction in my sound and a greater expansion of what I've come to call Gaelic Americana. <laughs> The Art of Forgetting will be comprised of nine originals, two songs in Scottish Gaelic, and a cover of Nancy Griffith's Trouble in the Fields. The album will be released in the fall of 2017, and between January and the autumn, Dirk and I will be developing the tracks and adding accompaniment from some of the best musicians in both Celtic and American music. But if there's one thing I've learned, one thing that has moved me the most through all of these experiences, travels, and adventures, it's that creative projects are best made with a community. And as a still independent American artist, I face a number of unique challenges. It's through the help of my friends and the support of my fans that I've been able to move forward with conviction in my career. And fan funding my previous album, the joy of sharing that experience with all of you, only made me want to do it all again. To continue to bring you new music and continue to share my stories and adventures with you through song. Oops, with your help, I will be able to record, print, and promote the art of forgetting, and I hope so very much that we can bring this music into the world together. Thank you so much for your consideration, for your support, and for joining me in this labor of love and affection. I'll never forget that you are by my side, in my art, and most importantly, in my heart. Tank Void. Thank you. Hook me up, I'm coping.